Welcome back to the J Play Play Along of Ripto's Rage. This is part 14. Probably gonna be the final part. I don't know. It depends on how long this last part takes. But it won't really take that long because last time we got the rest of the orbs and we finished off the rest of the worlds in Winter Tundra. Now only one obstacle remains and he's right through this door that was previously opened and I'm wondering why it isn't. Thank you, Tutorial Girl. Let's go! Hey, Shorty! Maybe I can help. What? You again? Yep. If you want to test that power crystal, why don't you try it on me? I'll stand still. I promise. Hmm. I like that idea. Dragon, you've just sealed your fate! How many of you actually stood still, like Spyro said? That is a bad idea in this fight. Spyro, we want to help you fight Ripto. Elora is using the orbs you collected to store power-up energy. Hunter will throw the powered-up orbs to you as they become ready. Even as we speak, the professor is experimenting with new forms of power-up energy, so you'll soon have abilities that no one has ever seen before. Awesome. Wait for it. Okay, that's my favorite part of the song. The Adinero. I just wanted to hear that again. Now, about this, about this fight, oh my god, he's shooting fireballs at it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Remember the, <clears throat> remember the crystal popcorn getting game? Yeah, that's pretty much what this is. Oh, jeez, no. <clears throat> Once you collect three orbs, you can pretty much, oh man, he dodged everything. That sucks. No, get away, get away. Aw, oh, crap. Now I have pretty much have to... Oh, no! Oh, boy. That's not good. Man, man. <clears throat> I should probably explain about the uh, these colored orbs that you've never seen before. Oh, no! The red ones are pretty much... Uh, uh, every third orb you collect, you get a freaking power-up. <clears throat> Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. No. I forgot you could move him out of the way. <clears throat> For the red ones, it's a, um... For the red ones, it's super flame. For the... Whoa. For the green ones, it's some sort of acid bomb. And for the blue ones, it's supercharged. Yes! Awesome. Unfortunately, they don't last too long. Ah! I just... I just got that, Butterfly! You suck! This is a pretty... Oh, no! He's gonna get... Yeah, oh, my goodness! Oh, my goodness! Oh, my goodness! Talk about crazy fire! Ah! One more shot. No. Now it's one more shot. Oh no, this is bad. Whoa. Yes. Oh my goodness. I needed that full life. Get out of here. Mm -mm. He dodged everything. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Aw, oh, man, he got another one. This is taking much longer than I thought it would. Stop it. You stop it right now. Aw, oh, man. Darn it! Stop that! What? Why would you 
you drop those two right next to- Oh my goodness, he did it again. Shoot him! Thank you! On to phase two! Guess who's back? Frickin' Mecha Gulp. Oh, great. Guess what? Gulp can pick these things up too! And- Whoa! Oh. Ow! And now he has leverage, which means his shots are more accurate. Great. No! Why did I just- sit there and let that happen. Ow! Man, I'm just not doing that well. Ah, no! No! How did that happen, man? Ugh! I had a feeling that was gonna happen! I gotta work on my dodging skills. Those fireballs are no joke! Counter attack! Oh, jeez! No. 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 I will not allow you. Oh, jeez. That seems to be working. Ouch. Yeah! Except that didn't work at all! Whoa! Whoa! Okay, let's... I don't remember what power-up he gets when he gets a... Uh, blue orb? But oh, jeez! I'm not willing to find out. Oh, man. Here comes the rapid fire again. I should have got hit there, but thank goodness I didn't. You might want to keep an eye on Hunter so that you. <clears throat> so that you don't accidentally give uh, Ripto an orb. Stop right there! Okay, he's over there, so. Sure enough. Acid bombs! Get out of here! Yeah. No, it comes the wave of power again. Urya! Urya! But too bad, I can jump over all. Oh man, he stole that one right from under me. I'm really bad at grabbing crystal popcorn, if you can't tell. No. Yes, okay. Phase two. Let's not screw this up like we did last time. Great. Oh, no. Probably better to go for the sheep anyway. Oh, man. No. Yes. Oh, shoot.
Darn it. It does shoot where you're going to aim to be, but... If you could psych him out. No, 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 no. Oh, shoot. Now he's going to shoot another one of those lava snakes. Run. Run. Huh, looks like one of those. Oh, my. You can make him hit himself? I did not know that. That is fantastic. Let's go. Oh, I can only hit him twice. Mine. Get over here. Oh. Oh, dinero. <laughs> Get out of there. Supercharge. Let's go. Third time. Yes. You're going to go for that one. I'm going to go for this one. I really like this fight. This is probably... Oh, no. Crap, 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 crap. I don't know what I know what he's going to do. Oh, God. He's probably going to charge. What the hell? Wow. So that's where the sorcerers got that attack. Whoa. Stop aiming where I'm going to be and start aiming where I am. Uh... Hunter, whose side are you on? Really? Get this one, get this one, get this one. Okay, focus on dodging, focus on dodging. Oh my goodness. It's not as clustered as the sorceress's attack, though. Acid bomb! Let's go! Oh no! Worth it! And then this happens. Boom! Oh no! Hunter! What are you doing? No! You're supposed to fly back up! What? No! The lava! Oh, God. So we pick up one of these golden things, and then Ripto shoots the floor off. And this golden orb actually gives us super fly and super, um, flame for the duration, of, for the rest of the fight. But this is awesome, because, oh my goodness. Alright, I should probably switch to analog stick, and, oh boy. Yeah, let's go. Oh, no. He shoot green fireballs at us. This is not... That does not translate to... Oh, what? He actually hit me. Okay. First, we want to duck. It's pretty much spamming. Fireball battle in the sky. Do, 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 do. This third, this third phase is infinitely simpler. So all you have to do is shoot him as he's approaching you, and then whittle down his health. Like, apparently, I mean, eventually he'll start to go around the castle, which is filled with lava. Um, I'm thinking about that, and that's not making any sense. And that's it. Why is a castle filled with lava? Why is it not flooding out onto the tundra? Why am I imagining things in video games? We can ever thank you enough, Spyro. I suppose you have to go now? Yeah, I'd better. They'll be missing me in the Dragon Worlds, and I've still got a vacation to take. I need it more than ever now. Before you go, I think that Moneybags has something he wants to give you. Hmm, I most certainly do not. Hunter? Spyro, Moneybags is very sorry that he made you pay so much on your way through Avalar. We want you to keep the gems as a reward for helping us. Wow, thanks. Sparks, can you grab them? 
Let me just type in the new coordinates and... There! Spyro, you can now go to Dragon Shores. Hey, why don't you guys come with me? I bet you could use a holiday. I'm afraid we can't, Spyro. Mikto may be gone, but he caused a lot of damage during his short stay. We'll be cleaning up for weeks. Just remember, though, that you can always get back to Avalar from Dragon Shores if you want to visit. Well, okay. Come on, Sparks. We've got a lot of vacation to catch up on. How did Bundy Bags recover from that? We will never know the extent of Ursine's stamina. And you just might notice this is the same ending theme as on the first Spyro Dragon. Well, that wasn't my idea. Stuart Copeland is the one who composed these pieces. Although they're so great that to me it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter now what happened. And we'll never give up the fight. I haven't rhymed at all, and that will not change because. You know what? No. I'm not gonna put you through two verses of that again. Oh, glimmer. Tutorial level. I still think it's a pretty cool uh, concept for a level, even though it's really simple. I wish there was like a challenge mode, but then that's me wishing stuff from the future. To games from the past. That doesn't work. Alright, so that's pretty much Ripto's Rage in a nutshell. After this, pretty much everything is, um... I should stop saying pretty much. Pretty much. Mm, I should stop saying pretty much. Yeah, after this is post-game content, which I'm probably gonna stuff in a different video or something like that. We still have the... We still have... Uh, rest of the skill points to catch and we have um one more part after that well actually the part after that is coming up next so after that would be the skill points but first i want to pick up something very important those who have played ripto's rage you know what it is and i thought i'd have See, this is what I was afraid of. I knew that I wouldn't have enough commentary to cover the credits, because I usually don't, because I'm an introvert like that, but... Ugh, I knew this was going to happen. I just knew it. And then Sunny Beach. Dive to the water. Through the tunnel. And then we see playing the crap out of everything. Oh, now the doors are open. No turtles. No chef. Okay. Fantastic. Wonderful. You couldn't have done this before? You couldn't have, like, opened the... As a matter of fact, there's no portal either. Okay. And then onto Scaleless Badlands, and then we notice that all the lava toads are missing, and the flame heads, and the cat bats, and the... And the invincibility power-up. And everything. You know, maybe... It wouldn't be a bad idea for one of the, the bad guys to remain and then start messing with the camera. Something like that. You know this is one of those songs that even though it, it has a really short loop, you just can't stop listening to it. Actually, this is the Misty Bach theme. Why did they bring this back for, uh, for Ripto's Rage? Why didn't they use, like, Zephyr? No, Zephyr isn't one of the more, um... Yeah, Stuart Copeland! <clears throat> yeah, Zephyr isn't one of the more memorable, um, things, even though he spent forever in there because of the frickin' Cowlick uh, mission. Um, let's see. Which one would I use? I think I would use... Fracture Hills, because you do hear that song more than once in the game. It's also used for Idle Springs. Yeah, I think I would use that one. Although the game, uh, the song that I don't really remember all of that much, because um, because of all the sounds going on at the same time, is um, the one for Gulp's Overlook. 
So I, I had I pretty much have to listen to that one separately. Oh, look at that, we're done! Dragon Shores! Post-game content, here we go! Hello, um... Crocodile? Alligator? Vector's cousin? Well done, Spyro. Step right on into Dragon Shores Park. Now, normally he wouldn't say that. Normally he would, um, ask you for 8,000 gems and 55 orbs before you can be granted access into the... Because this is a sort of a bonus, um... Sort of a bonus level, if By you will. The way, if you win 10 tokens, you can visit our theater. Oh, sure, let's do that. Now, other than that, there's just this. And then the portal back to Winter Tundra. And then you've got a dragon. I guess that's a shout out to the original Spyro. And then, um, yeah, not even a force field. So all you have is Ganiles and this two-bit pool here, as my cousin called it, I remember. <clears throat> so let's go win some tokens. Oh, there's so many um, people here. Uh, what do we do first? Let's do that! Oh, look, it's the Yeti from Colossus! Step right up, Spyro, and take a look at what we've got for you today. Inside this here booth, you'll find some of the most vicious creatures you've ever seen. You know what I just noticed? Gnick? Gniles? The previous game? These guys are Norks! What are the Norks doing in Dragon Shores? Here's a baseball to spit, sport. Take aim. Shoot at the target and watch as the terrifying creatures fall into the water below. But don't worry, you won't hurt them. What if I want to hurt them? They caused me so much pain, except for the claw, uh, except for the Yeti. Um, he just kind of killed himself. So I feel bad for doing this, but um, what the? Hold down the triangle button. Thanks. Blah 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 blah. Hey, <laughs> that was pretty funny, wasn't it? Take this token for being such a good shot. That's one. Now, let's show off some of the other things. We've got... This thing here, and then... We've got... Actually, I have no idea what most of these things is, except for that tunnel of love thing over there. What have you got for me? Welcome to the Dragon Shores Coaster. Here at the shores, we don't just ride, though. If you can pop all the balloons on the track, a token is waiting for you. Ready to ride? Sure thing. Watch out for the other coasters out there. It's a crowded track today. I actually don't remember this mission. Well, this is kind of exciting. Baby turtles on my track? Get out of here. Aw, oh, man. Did that just really happen? I jumped over... Electro? The hell? Oh, you don't actually have to jump over them. Aw. Oh. oh, cool. You get unlimited laps until, um... Until you pop all the balloons. That's nice. Considering it didn't have a, um, a difficulty meter. Good job, dragon. Here's a token for you. Yeah. That's two tokens. All right, I'll flip this switch and now you can ride more tracks. See if you can pop the balloons on these tracks, too. Oh. I, wow. Watch out for the other. I really don't remember anything about this. But yeah, apparently there's 50 balloons this time, man. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Jumping over there. Out of my path. Alright, let's go for the, um, the alternate paths. At least I'm gonna try to. It is holding left, right? Yes, yes it is. Oh. Jump for that one. That's pretty nice. 
Let's not pull a harbor trolley. The trouble, though... Someone needs to really move that baby turtle. I mean, I'm gonna run over him by accident, and then everyone's gonna blame me for actually, um, for actually running him over. Although he should know not to be in the way of a, tr a crowded, um, a crowded roller coaster. But no, just blame it on all of the dragon. Uh. Loop de loop. Although it doesn't seem to be working as well as it did in uh, in any of the Sonic games. But oh, whatever. Hey, not bad. Here's another token. Sweet. There's one more run, and you're on a roll. There's a cannon installed on your car for this run, and you'll have to shoot balloons too. Are you gonna give it a try? Oh no! Watch out for the other coast. They are pulling a, a, a harbor trolley thingamabob. Oh great! Now I'm gonna have to shoot things out of the way. What's over here? Ah! I'm gonna have to go get that one again. Big red balloons. Even though they're much larger than the green ones, I still can um, aim worth a damn. <clears throat> let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I wish there were a button to like speed up or something. No! Aw oh, man. I wanted to go down that way. Yeah! Alright. We're not doing as badly. Come on, speed up, speed up, speed up! Jump that one. Jump the. Oh. Okay, never mind. I'll just go around again. Get that one on the back swing. Okay. There we go. No! That is a trick jump. Ow, that looked like it hurt. Care for another try at the coast? What? Wow. That was nowhere near as good. Hashing X! I didn't think I would ever have this much trouble with post-game content, but apparently... Someone just loves to- HIT BOXES! There we go, now we're on a roll. Hopefully. A double roll. A toasty twist. Oh, you can shoot the green balloons too! I didn't think I would ever pull that off. Apparently there's something I missed though. So I tried mixing, um... Oh, I need some more drink actually. I tried mixing pineapple soda and green tea. That is not the best combination. Shoot you, pop. Pop. I bet there's one more red balloon just waiting to be popped. Or not. This works. Hooray! Wow, you're a natural. You've conquered the coaster. Here's my last token. And that is a four tokens. You can ride again for fun if you want. What's over here? Hi, you Spyro. I hear you're a pretty good shot. How'd you like to try my shooting gallery? Oh boy, the shooting gallery. Yes, no. <laughs> That's okay, pretty I'll nice. set the timer for you. Now I don't know what to do. Oh. Oh, snap. That is what you do. You shoot the ducks. Later on there's going to be things that pop out of those holes and you have to shoot those too. I'm the greatest shot in the world. I keep spamming. Nice shooting. Here's a token. Oops. Hit the mic by accident. Ready for the next round? Ready for the next round? Okay, I'll set the timer for you. 
Oh, snap. It's these guys. I'm the best shot in the world. Done. Nice shooting. Here's a token. I should be used I shouldn't be using the D-pad for this. Ready for the next round? There's a next round? Okay. Oh shoot, it's those squirrels from Glimmer. Lizards or whatever. I'm gonna take great pleasure in grinding your bones to dust. Look at how high they fly. I remember Super Flame has a way of doing that. Oh my goodness, I just got that. Right. Here is my last token. I remember in Year of the Dragon we shoot rabbits with Super Flame. They go freaking high. It's a love coaster. Let's go. Oh my god, it's Agent Zero. Skip that one. Free, free, free. Oh you my goodness, no I just saw the greatest no thing payments. ever. In return, I'll give you one token. One is all I can give, but you can ride as many times as you'd like. Okay, I'm just gonna, um, I'm just gonna rewind a bit, so you can see the greatest thing ever for yourself as well. Oh my god, an Earth Shaper! <laughs> oh, we're still at blue health. It's a shame we can't fix that, but... Chef and a baby tur- He's still trying that, isn't he? Oh, look at that Earth Shaper getting lucky. <laughs> and then forever alone. There it is! <clears throat> hey, Vaughn, not As that bad. Promised, here's your one token. When you have ten, try visiting the Dragon Shores Theater. Sure thing. And we have eight right now, so, um, uh... Where do I get that last two tokens? Actually, I would like to know. Oh, that's right. You get it from this guy. And, oh, the Yeti's back. Stop not holding down the triangle button. My triangle button's wonky. That's weird. Let's get another token. This is pretty easy, isn't it? Have another one of these tokens. It's the... Is that the chef? I think that's the master chef. It is the master chef. Oh, boy. This is a great honor to, to bear witness to my 10th token. Wow, you really are a great shot. Take this. It's my last token. And that is 10 tokens. With this, we can access the theater, which is right over here. Well, Spyro, it's your lucky day. You've managed to win enough tokens to enter the famous Dragon Shores Theater. Go on in and enjoy the show. And the best part, you don't even have to pay to watch. Here you can watch cutscenes from the previous moments in this game. Education, I got a dragon, all these little things. Every single one. But the best part, the best part, oh my goodness, you have no idea. So I have 10,000 gems and 64 orbs, right? What you do with these 10,064 treasures is, you see that door here? That unlocks the greatest treasure in this game. By far. But wait, it's just a super flame portal, you say? No, it's not just a super flame portal. It is a permanent super flame portal. Yes. Your mind just got fucked blown. I should watch my language, but still! It's permanent super flame? This makes things so easy. And I will 
I will label those things as super easy. You will see for yourself in the next part of the J-Play play along of Ripto's Rage. I guess so. Join me for the next part when I go through collecting skill points for your enjoyment. Peace. Actually, this seems like a good opportunity to um, show something a little bit different. So if you quit the game, uh-huh, let it go through the title screen, sort of stuff, stuff, it is stuff, stuff, stuff. Press start. After you get this, uh, this permanent super flame thingamabob. It is this slot, right? Yes, yes it is. 100%! Start a new game, right? In the world of dragons. Yes, jump, 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 boop, boop. Meanwhile, in the world of Avalar, things have gone awry! Again! I really wish we could go back to Avalar in a Spyro game and just be like, Sup, guys? Ready to go on another adventure? Now, if I remember correctly, you should be able to shoot Super Flame at the very beginning of the game! What the hell's going on? Hi, Spyro! Welcome to Glimmer! Yeah, you just go through the game with your um, with your newfound ability, and just beat the ever living crap out of everything. Hi, Spyro. That, that means of course, you'll still have to go through the tutorial, but whatever, it's worth it to just plow through everything, and you'll still have to pay money bags. But whatever, we still have freaking Super Flame at the very beginning of the game. Look at I'm not even worried that I ran into that large enemy with a hammer. Come on. Come on. This is a sticker. Hold your hands where I can see. Well, they already are where I can see them, but still. Boom! It's not work for any of the other abilities, though. So, there's that. Alright, see you guys next time. Oh man, that's so cool! So cool!